So the, the first two we're going to do is this one, which is the Samsung dryer thermistor. And that's the DC32. That's what that is. And then also the uh, DC47 fuse, which is thermal fuse. Now check this out. You got the thermostat, a thermistor, thermistor, a thermal fuse, and a thermal limit fuse. These all sound very similar. So if you were confused looking up these parts, that's why. But they're all different. I'm going to show you how to replace this one and this one right now. These ones, if you take the back off, just the pipe, there's just a screw. You take the, and then you can pull the pipe out after you take that screw out. Now these are located. Sorry about that right here on the back of the uh, blower so the white one is the uh, thermal fuse and this blue one is to the thermistor now those are right there let me zoom in um, only held in by a Phillips screw so I'm gonna go ahead and unscrew them one screw right there one screw right there unscrew those two pull them out and put your new ones in put the screw in and then plug them back in that's how to do those ones and guys once you get your new one i would just measure the resistance on it make sure it's even good these parts are so cheap nowadays make sure it's good before you even put it in this one should be about 0 0.06 on the ohms all right i got about 0 0.05 kilo ohms and that's with it on 20k so i'm gonna go and put this one in because i know it's good okay i got my new one in now the thermistor that thermistor now here's my ohm out of my old thermistor 10.26 I'll do my brand new one here's my brand new one about 9.8 all right I'm gonna go and put this one in now on this one there's a little slot that this goes up into and then once it's in the slot you go up into it then you could put the screw in the bottom hole. Now you put the bottom screw in. Alright I got that in. Now just put our connectors on. Boom just like that. And make sure there's no lint that's in the connectors causing a uh, you know no, no problems with the so that's how to replace those two sensors. Check my other videos in the Samsung playlist for more repairs on this dryer. Thanks for watching.